Okay, so we have the fold down here. It opens up. So what we're gonna do is our name needs to be in this space. And, but we wanna think about the first letter being the tallest and then it kind of coming down to a point, okay? So you want it, the smallest letter should probably be maybe about an inch over here. So if it helps, you can kind of make a, make a little mark right there to kind of indicate that. So I'm gonna show you an example of what I'm talking about. So say I'm writing my first name, my first name is Karis. So my first letter is a C. Now, if you are a um, handwriting person, you can totally do this in handwriting too. It does not matter. My second letter is an H. I can make a letter a little wider if I want to. Um, but I wanna, again, I wanna think about that diagonal kind of line. So my third letter, I can do it capital. I can do it lowercase. It does not matter. And then you're gonna notice that as my letters go down, they get shorter and shorter. And then even if I want to do my last initial, I can make that a T and done. Boom. Okay. So there's my name. Now, the next part of this is what we're going to do is we are going to trace around those letters. Okay. So it kind of is going to make a shape like this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pencil. I'm obviously using a pen and I'm just going to make a line that goes around. So it's like barely touching those. And then I'm gonna stop that line, okay? Where I had that line here. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn my paper, okay? So this is actually gonna be my skeleton head. Once I cut it out, these are gonna be my horns. So I want to um, think about the shape that I'm doing my horns. So you can have your horns come up this way. You can have your horns curl around if you want to. And I'm gonna show you an example of what that looks like in just a minute.